So this little dude is currently eating. But I just wanted to show the mess that's going on in this room. I got my postpartum belly bands, some clothes that are too big for him, um, my twist pouches, which is for the breast milk that I'm storing, all his other breastfeeding stuff, my pump over there with the clean parts. I got the laptop here that I'm trying to update so I can edit his birth vlog and um, the little montage I'm putting together. <sighs> Abby's spot over there, which is actually not that dirty right now. Then we got his little baby bouncer, which is pretty cool. But we don't have batteries for it. And then we got this dirty boy over here. Sunny sick shower. I gotta get a haircut, bro. Yeah, you do. And then, you guys, I don't know if you can see. Oh, yeah, there's like a stain. Not your arm, bro. Abby's just spilled orange juice and it like slid off the tray and went all over the couch and yeah so grab them up. yeah pretty much it's a mess hey what'd you like go for look at he gets so mad he lets go and he gets mad <laughs> all right be back this little dude is currently drunk off of some milk but believe it or not he's already a week old he's been with us an entire seven days and things are pretty good i would say getting uh used to not really a routine but just like going with motions going with the flow he's not really like a difficult baby right now for now but um yeah, this is pretty much all we do. He just burped right now. But, um, feed him, burp him, change him, and then he goes back to sleep or he'll stay up for a while. It's January 23rd, and hopefully soon we can, uh, start bringing him out and stuff because I just want to heal up and feel better and show my baby off. Alright, Ezekiel. Okay, look at you got fan. Is yours the same as mine? Oh, because you can't do it like that, baby. You do it like this. Bam. 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 Wow. You can have that one. I'll use the car, okay? So use the car. In the middle, so I can get as many blocks as I can, and then I'll start building. Mm -hmm. right here. No, this is mine. You have that one. I can't build nothing. Yes, you can. Try. You have to try. Okay. Try to build something. How about we build a long, big box square thing, right? Bye, Sky. <laughs> See you later, Skies. Uh oh, this guy's getting up. No, no, no. We gotta leave him alone. We don't want him up. We want him sleeping. So, these guys are down there. Hi. You can see them. I can see them there. I can see them. They're right back there. It's really dark in there. It is really dark in there. Let's see if I can see. Nope, I'm not gonna do it. Because it's gonna fall and then you're gonna be super mad at me. Well, good job, Abby. Good. So we built a, a different one. Same thing, but different. Good. All right, so what, what, what do we, what's new on this one? 
this way. We put the door on the top and then we drop them in the tunnel. And then it drops, and it should be at the bottom of this door, right? Where's the worst guy? Uh oh, I got stuck. <laughs> where is he? Mm -hmm. Okay, let's see. Let's see where Sky's at. <gasps> Sky's right there. Mm -hmm. She got stuck. Oh no! Did she mm -hmm. fall? Mm -hmm. No, she didn't. She's stuck at the window. Oh man. There she is. She fell out. Now you have to do it again. You do it again? Okay, yeah. let me see if I can. Uh oh. So maybe uh, maybe you can only do small toys, okay? Um, no, I can't. What? Want you you want to use Sky still? Ah! Let's put him in here. That one's definitely gonna work. <gasps> I didn't even hear it fall. Oh man, he did fall. He fell. He fell! You guys, that was the best shower I've ever, ever had. Um, and you know, as a woman, if you've had a child, you really take for granted, um, Okay. Shaving, <laughs> shaving your legs and doing all that stuff. Cause when you're pregnant, you got a big old basketball in front of you, and you and cannot see past like that it. basketball. Nor can you see your feet because your tummy is so big. Um, can I take it off? No. Why? That's weird. So weird. It's weird. So the homies just hit me up right now. Oh yeah? Yeah. Yeah. And the homies are like, yo Z. Can you still, can you You gotta hop on and I'm like, yo, you're probably right. I'm gonna hop on right now. Mommy, can you show daddy your, can you show daddy your shot? Look at, look at, mommy got a shot right here. <laughs> mommy got a shot right here. <laughs> Come on, baby. Come on, baby. Come on, I gotta, I gotta get all of you. I'm mm. eating you. I'm eating you. I'm eating you now. <laughs> I'm eating you. You're in my tummy. <laughs> <laughs> this man doesn't know what to do with his life if it's not on his phone or his monitor. Or the TV. Mm, I'm about to take a nap, he forgets bro. how to live life without all that stuff. Check it out, you guys. Got my my baby carrier. <laughs> this one was supposed to be for Ezekiel, but I can't figure out the cute one, the wrap. So this is gonna have to do for now. I don't know if it's a good idea. He just wants to eat. <laughs> Even though he just ate. Yeah, I like this. Now I can uh, do a bunch of stuff and just have him right here in my face. And potentially have him throw up on me too. <laughs> Something I uh, just thought about. Throw up on. <laughs> I should try it out. Yeah. See how it goes? Probably cool right there. Like this? He's just like, uh, get me out of here. <laughs> <laughs> Daddy, trim your mustache. Oh, baby. Trim your mustache, Daddy. Let's see. I was gonna edit right now. This is why I wanted him on this thing. Let's do this. Uh, Sky, move. Go. Am I smashing your feet? Are you good? Are you okay? I don't think he cares. He's all, uh, uh. Yeah, no. He just wants to eat. That's it. <laughs> Sometimes gotta be happy. <laughs> 
<laughs> Sometimes you go to be like. Okay, is he gonna cry? See, he's gonna cry. Like the light. <laughs> okay, I want to see you from crying. Yeah. At this Okay, okay. All right, all right. Sometimes you gotta be happy. Sometimes you gotta be happy. He's hella mad. Alright, so real quickly, I just want to say that this is actually a really good thing to have. Um, I, I said it was the knockoff of the Hakka thing, but I don't really know what came first. But when you're feeding your baby, if you don't know about this, you put this on the other side and it basically collects the letdown. Um, I put this on like seconds before latching them on the other side and this was like accumulated within five minutes, so. If you don't have one, you should get one because otherwise all of this that came out is basically in um, your nursing pad that's, you know, there for your bra. So I'd get this. I do have a link for my 39 week video from Amazon. This is cheaper than the Hakka and it comes with more things than the Hakka comes with. So I will get this. It's called Nature Bond. I'm not sure if that's clear. But it comes with this, some strap. Um, it has this to um, keep you know, the milk from spilling, but it also has a cap that comes with it as well. And I forgot what else, but like a little baggy, a little carrying bag for it too. So um, yeah, if you guys haven't already, you should get this. All right, look what we got going on over here. He's dancing behind you. That's hella cute. Aww. Look at mommy. You better not be throwing it up on me, Paul. Yeah, you gotta keep that up. Look at mama. So. Hey, stop. This is how he's gonna be gaming, you guys. How do you feel? He's all bleh. Just goes up in your face on stream, Mom. Yeah, one, one's bottom red. <laughs> yeah, it's uh, it was castle, castle bottom red. Look at this father. What a good father. <laughs> okay, you guys, so it's um, January 26th or 27th. Stressful. I have no idea. I'm gonna try to talk over my husband because there's no way he's gonna shut up. But, um, so it's been eight days since I've had this little one, and I just wanted to share what's, what's going on with me physically. Um, so the third degree tear, tearing doesn't feel that excruciating anymore, but when the pain meds, uh, you know, wear off, it start. I feel like a throbbing pain down there. Um... I haven't really seen any stitching come out yet. Those usually like, I don't know if you can say absorb, but they basically like disintegrate and they'll come off in like pieces. So um, yeah, that's how that's going. I'm still using uh, the Dermaplast, I'm still using the Tux. Um, the, what is it? Is it a Perry bottle? I don't know what that's even called. But um, yeah, still using that. I still need stool softeners. Right now I'm taking Motrin and Tylenol. It's pretty much it, um, every six hours. Let me put you guys down because my arm is hurting. Yeah, so I'm taking, um, still taking stool softeners. Um, taking one Motrin and two Tylenols every six hours. By like the fourth hour, I already start to feel the pain and then like, I start limping, like I can't walk, like that's how bad it is, but, um, I took the medicine like 30 minutes ago. It's already kicking in. Um, and my weight is what I'm super excited about. So, I'm very short. I will not disclose how short I am. But I had gained, um, well, I don't know how much I gained, like, a fat. Right now, I'm still trying to determine how much that is. But the last time I weighed myself, which I think was the day that I had the baby, um... Abby. I'm just taking off my... Leaving? Yeah. 
He's, he's, being, he's, he's dropping off a bed. Dropping off a bed? Yeah, like ours. Oh, ours that was in the backyard? Yeah. Yeah, so when I weighed myself last, when I was pregnant, I was 191 pounds, you guys. I almost hit 200 pounds. And with Abby, I hit uh, 170. And I only gained 10 pounds with her. Okay. Okay, guys, don't get got that choopy. Yes, that's her brother's choopy. But, um, yeah, this time around, when I um, started off, I was, like, between 145 to 150. I was already, like, kind of gaining weight again after losing 20 pounds. He doesn't like it. Yeah, he doesn't like it. He's going to start crying. Mm -hmm. But eight days later, you guys, I went from 191. Okay, no more, baby. I went from 191 and I'm currently 164. Yesterday I was 168, I think. Um, my dad has a scale in his bathroom, so I always hop on there. But yeah, 164. I'm hoping that, uh, you know, I can drop it down into the 150s and then when it's time to, you know, when I get the go from my doctor, that I can start like moderately working out. Um, hopefully I can get to my goal that I wanted to and then plus of course breastfeeding does help um, They say it burns five to seven hundred calories a day Obviously depending how much you do it and how much your baby's eating um, At his appointment he freaking ate more than four ounces and I, he was just on my right side So I had a lot of milk. It, it's reducing a lot um, the engorgement isn't that crazy anymore like kind of is but at the same time it's not really hurting like it was in the beginning like the first couple of days so i'm hoping that kind of like goes away too but yeah um stuff's looking up uh we might start meal prepping again we actually stopped because ezekiel didn't want to do it anymore and um yeah so you know my lactation nurse was just telling me like don't make the mistake of worrying too much about your diet like just eat a balanced meal you know stay hydrated and she was just keeping in mind like there's like starving mothers out there that are still able to feed their kids because they just stay consistent with it so hopefully i can last longer than a month because i didn't last long with abby but i also you know it's my first kid i wasn't sleeping yes you i wasn't sleeping a lot i wasn't drinking enough water i definitely was not cooking with her um I pretty much just like depended on my mom and um this time around the routine's already starting to like come into action i guess you can say um i'm not feeling that tired having to wake up for him or anything um the only thing is he's kind of getting not getting he's having a little bit trouble with latching now um, I was using like one of those guards because he wasn't doing it correctly and um, I don't know there's days where he'll latch on like naturally and days that he wants or not wants but he has a really hard time and I have to put the um the thing on him so yeah that's the only dilemma right now that's kind of make me frustrated um, as far as like baby blues I don't really know exactly what that is but I dropped like a cup of water yesterday and it pulled all over the floor and I started crying. <laughs> so I imagine that has something to do with like the hormones leaving my body of course. Um, yeah, I was crying and I could not stop crying and just like really um, depressing kind of thoughts were in my head and I had to just like sit there and keep telling myself like it was the hormones and i just let myself cry i wanted to like let it out i feel fine today yeah yesterday i started getting a little frustrated and then um ezekiel took over he didn't even know i was crying he came in the room and see me and then he just started to do everything that i needed to get done so yeah but other than that stuff's good um hopefully you can start meal prepping again because ezekiel also wants to lose some weight <laughs> mostly for him too um he's getting a lot he's getting enough he's getting weight and that makes me happy so this guy's out <laughs> i fed him a couple couple hours ago 
for like almost two hours now right, and then right, last night right. he slept for a while he let me sleep yeah I i'm not really trying to like wake him during the night um he wakes up on his own and um oh it's long baby <laughs> but yeah i didn't i didn't want to wake him um, i needed the rest too and then he only feeds for like 10 minutes um the nurse said to make him feed longer but then when she seen that he got more than four ounces in half an hour she was like okay now i know why because you're producing so much and um Bruh, I yeah know <laughs> I don't know how he's, I he's a little fatty he's a monster i still have yet to show you guys how he like screams when he's frustrated it's pretty crazy but yeah that was the update um eight days later been a week with this little man in our presence and things are going good things are going really really good <laughs> she's so cute Hi. right now we're about to go to where are we going Alka. we're going to her grandpa's we're gonna let um the kids well the preteens teenagers yeah, his brothers and sisters are gonna meet the baby. Ew. They're gonna meet the baby for the first time. If they're there. I honestly don't know if they are. But this little man's sleeping right now, I think. Oh. Oh, come up. Yeah, we're gonna go over there. Um, we were just gonna drop, well, he was gonna drop Abby off, but I want them to see the baby, so. <laughs> Let's go and go bye-bye. Let's go to Papa's. Do you you gonna bring any toys? I'm gonna bring this. That's it. Come on, say, look at me. Where did this curl <laughs> where did that curl come from? I literally just used like the best comb to fix your hair. Let me see. Wait. Me. Stop moving. <laughs> little one knocked out when she's like doing the most is when you know she's tired <laughs> she like doesn't know how to take it out of her system any other way but then to be insane hey stop showing my face dude me all blast everywhere <laughs> let me see what i wrote what does it say read that loud don't cheat on me please i love you <laughs> <laughs> Looks like you're crying, kinda. Don't It's probably like freaking hella tired. <laughs> Are you awake now? Yeah. Help me. <laughs> Help me. I gotta get baby brother. Oh man. Come this way, stay on that side. Hey, look, you got drool on your shirt. You got drool. Is it cool? Papa lives right here. You know where Papa lives. <laughs> Can I go up the stairs? Yeah, we're going up the stairs. Go, go, go. Can you do it? Hold on, babe. Can't even see you. The sun is like your head. Hey, don't vlog us. We're in the open. Hi, Abby. Hi, guys. Dang. That was crazy. He lifted up with his nose. Oh, my God. He said, shut up. Go. Oh, my God. 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 Oh, my Turn it around and see yourself. Hey! Yep! 
Camera's dying. Super uneventful. He let it die. Okay, so this is totally random, but for some reason, I don't even remember why, Ezekiel said when the baby comes, he's gonna shave his mustache, and I don't know about his like goatee thingy, but uh, he is actually trimming right now, and then he was like, remember what I said when the baby comes? And I totally forgot about it, but he said he's gonna do it, so I've never seen him without a mustache. <laughs> You're gonna see why I don't like my I've always wanted this. <laughs> Stop, bro. But anyways, he got a haircut. His hair is not done. I have to braid it. I feel like so funny. <laughs> okay, I'm ready. Damn it! <laughs> Are you ready? Yeah. I'm not ready, bro. Come on. This is my, my mustache right here. This is my, my baby. I told him it's fine because his mustache is going to grow back in like yeah, two days. You want to do like a... Zip, so it's like I can't. Well, because me, I can't start it, but if you like do like a zip, then I'm gonna have to start it, right? Mm -hmm. <laughs> I would be like, <laughs> How am I supposed to record? Oh my god, I'm so scared. My lip is all <laughs> shaking. Oh my gosh, you know how to do this. <laughs> look at me, look at me, look at me. Do half of it first, okay? Half of it? Yeah. Oh my gosh. Never been so happy. <laughs> Either. It doesn't look bad. Oh my god. Are you really gonna look 14 with a kid? With two kids? <laughs> Does that mean I gotta take, take this off? Oh, off? Yeah, yeah, do it. Go. I've never seen your chin. Go. I've never seen your chin. <laughs> You have to take it off. You have oh, to. No. You I have to. Bro, oh, I, I hate you. I swear. <laughs> this is true love, you guys. Oh, I just like feel bald. Oh my <laughs> gosh. True love. You know how long I've asked for this, you guys? <laughs> See what Abby says. See if she even knows this is. I bet you she won't. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> Bro, that was too much. Oh my god. <laughs> Hi. 